So the workout I just showed is mainly based around my shoulder. I had previously done some pull-ups and then afterwards I did some leg exercises, squats, stiff leg deadlifts and calf raises. Each of the upper body shoulder exercises I just showed were three sets of 15 reps. As you can see behind me, it's been snowing again in the UK. However, that is not the point of the vlog. Tonight is actually going to be BJJ grading with Master Leo. We haven't had one in almost two years now and I've only ever attended one before. So I thought I'd bring you guys along with me because it's kind of a bit of a different experience. People get whipped. Obviously people are pretty happy when they get their belts and stuff. So I thought you guys might be interested in that. For anyone that doesn't know, I'm a white belt. The gi's always been more of a long-term focus for me and I prefer to prioritize other things like boxing, Muay Thai, no gi, wrestling, overall MMA training because that's obviously my main focus. I do think it's really important though, I definitely recommend people doing it. The more I've done it, the more I've enjoyed it. I guess it's like anything really, you just have to be consistent and it takes time. Anyway, food time. Here we go peeps, so we've got two fillets of haddock, a baked potato, some tender stem broccoli, and half an avocado. I'm probably gonna chuck a bit of butter and mayonnaise on that. Right guys, very satisfying dinner there. I'm gonna chill out and I'll see you at the gym. Okay guys, uh... Coincidentally, for the grading day, I have these guys here with me. Uh, Vince, thank you for bringing them and uh, <laughs> keeping them with you. <laughs> it's amazing energy. They are really amazing uh, uh, competitors, very nice guys as well. We start the grading soon, yeah, the, the, the grading mission soon. But you can do your warm ups or stretching, whatever you want. to beat someone easier yeah but it's not what you want here yeah we we want to be able to defend yourself you don't want you fighting yeah so giving belts give you more responsibility as well not only here as well but outside if you had to fight because you, you couldn't avoid it but defend yourself is different and hopefully the BJJ will help you you know but attitude outside and here is that what you want so you want to pre uh, also prepare you for the life you have to be a nicer person yeah and, and so improving growing as a person as well not only as a fighter Gary uh, <laughs> Carrie won most of the 
competition, she, she competes most of the competitions by Bell. <laughs> a lot everything I need he helps he helps a lot here as well yeah, uh, you know how how dedicated he is with with you as well a bit tough sometimes but <laughs> 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 so uh, I decide to not to give him a, a, a strike no <laughs> Wow. Special moment for me, of course, for <laughs> but my first black belt, yeah, and so well deserved. Yeah, I can't be happy with that. And it's not only the, it's also attitude, it's other things. So it's a good example for everyone. Motivation, amazing. So guys. Really? Yeah, yeah. I don't even know what to say, guys. I wasn't expecting it. I know they never give any stripes, so I was like, I'll oh, write another year or so, you know. I wasn't expecting it at all, but it's a lot of guys here that helped me so much all the way. You know, I learned a lot from Jiu Jitsu, especially the them. learning how there is levels in between, like, in every bracket there's a level, there's a level here. And I think the past month, you know, I've been training with amazing people, you know, I've been trying to help everybody out and trying to get this energy from them. And I think the past month I learned so much, I learned that it's okay, you know, to, to be at your own level, at your own belt, you know. Sometimes, man, I, I felt about giving up so many times. Leo always took the beating of me, you know, being a bitch ass and asking him, like, I'm gonna leave, I'm packing my bag, I'm going home, it's not working out. You know, I have my best friend right here. We've been riding, you know, for how many years now? You know, I'm sorry, I'm a little bit emotional. It means a lot to me, you know. You know, me and Vince have been training for so long, and a lot of my students here too, most of you guys have trained with me for a long, long time, so. Just want to say thank you for everybody for a long ride, long, long ride. It's paid off, and uh, you know it's okay to feel a little sad sometimes. You know, sometimes you come in here and get your ass literally given to you and a plate, and you feel like giving up, and just gotta keep coming back, coming back, because it pays off. It pays off. I just want to say thank you to Leo for all the the teaching and being like a, a great um, a great figure for us just to, to follow up on his energy you know um, thank you for everything thanks guys thanks thank everybody I really appreciate it thank you. Uh, IBJJF uh, they have this rule you can only grade a black belt if you, only, if you have a, a, a two, at least two degrees uh, I, I have been black belt since 2004 uh, 13 years as black belt, right? Don't have any stripe, any, any degree there. But uh, I had a message from my master, Brazil Murilo, and he also decided to grade me. So. <laughs> <laughs> hey. 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 I couldn't go there for him to give me the, 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 the degrees, but he said I can even. Uh, I find maybe can can translate the, the phone message he gave me is so if I having now I have three degrees 
Right guys, back from the gym now. Good jiu-jitsu session there with everyone. Got promoted tonight to blue belt. To be honest, the belt itself doesn't actually mean that much to me. It's more the fact that it's come from Leo, who's not only a fantastic instructor, he's a good, genuine person. He's got a great outlook on life. He's positive, and I think everyone at the gym would agree he's the type of person that could be considered a role model. So after everyone got their belts, we had to do the whippings. Blue belts go twice, two laps on the gym. Purple belts go three times, brown belts four, and black belts five lengths. So I was kind of at the back of the blue belt queue. I'd seen how it was going, and everyone was kind of dawdling along, doing their lengths, getting whipped. So I thought I'd outsmart everyone and try power walk it, which backfired. Everyone just seemed to whip me harder. The other highlights were seeing Fabio Ferrari get his black belt, which is the first one Leo's ever given out, which obviously means a lot. And of course, seeing Leo get promoted himself to being a third degree black belt. Anyway, guys, that's the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please smash that like button, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Hey, 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 hey.